if you missed it, CG Cookie has recently added a new course on their website, and it is all about procedural modeling and animation in Blender's geometry nodes. We all know that geometry nodes may be used for a variety of tasks, still, its best use case is undoubtedly the assembly of modular elements to create models that are intricate and flexible. And because of this, it has recently been much more well known and it has gained a lot of popularity among Blender artists and among other software users as well. And we have seen a ton of video tutorials about it that have been released on YouTube. However, there are hardly any online courses or video tutorials that covers the entirety of geometry nodes for newbies. As a result, CG Cookie has created this course in which they thoroughly dive into the Blender's geometry node system in a lot of detail step by step. Therefore, the course is divided into three chapters. The first chapter to get comfortable with the geometry nodes and you will first learn about the fundamentals of it, including how it fits into the modifier stack, what the colors and shapes of the node sockets indicate, what each node means, and how to combine all of them, in addition to how to choose whether to model something by hand or with nodes. In the second chapter, you will be generating a ferris wheel, but before that, you will first learn about the most important and most frequently used nodes and how to create a new node group that you can later use in any project. Furthermore, the main concept will cover instance and models and how to create arrays of assets, in addition to how to generate a new geometry. You will also learn how to assemble and join parts together and how to optimize the node graph in order to get a better performance. Similar to the second chapter, in the third chapter, you will build another item, this time a roller coaster that is generated following a custom curve and a cart that consistently rolls down the track at whatever speed you choose. To finish up, you will learn how to solve certain mathematical problems using nodes and how to use conditional properties. In addition to how to align objects to curves, you will learn more about procedural animations and ray casting. But you need to keep in mind that you have to be familiar with the Blender interface and the fundamentals of modeling and shading nodes. You will notice that the course is a little bit technical and has a lot of information, but I think it is an ideal course because it is a step-by-step -step guide and offers high-quality information. Just before you go, I just wanted to provide a brief piece of information or advice. You could run into some difficulties when learning geometry nodes, but actually even experts in 3D find it sometimes challenging. This is simply because it is a new feature in Blender and a new concept, and there is a lot we haven't learned about it yet. So my advice is to simply take it slow, give it some time, and keep trying to learn it from scratch, and trying to follow along with the instructor of this course and practice bit by bit until you can create beautiful things. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Also subscribe to this channel. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video.